All right, so if I was to describe equity, I would say it's the amount of value that you actually own in your home. To come up with that number, you simply subtract the mortgage, the money that you owe to bank, from the value, how much the property would sell for today. The difference between the two is the equity, how much money or value you actually own in your property. Equity grows in two ways, either externally, meaning that the neighborhood changes and it becomes more desirable to live there, or internally, meaning home renovations. The combination of the two is how most people build their equity. So what can you do with it? Well, first, you can add it to your net worth because it's an asset. But you can also borrow against it. You can get a home equity loan or a line of credit from the bank. That's what they call a second mortgage because you end up with two payments each month, the payment for the original mortgage and then the payment for the new loan. Banks don't like the term second mortgage because it scares the fuck out of you, so they made a nicer, friendlier term, home equity loan. Same thing. Two, you can refinance your home. And that's redoing the mortgage all over again based on the new value of the home. You take cash out and now your mortgage starts over with a new higher payment. Now, depending upon how much you take out, it might not be that much higher. And finally, of course, you can sell your home and take the cash from the sale to purchase a new home. Those are three basic ways that you can access the equity in your home. Sidebar, most people build their real estate portfolio by refinancing, taking the cash out and then buying another property. To see how that works, click this video here. So equity is the most important part of home ownership. Yeah, safety, stability, and having a home with memories, all that shit matters too. But equity is the name of the game. Now you know what it is and how to use it.